Hey everybody, so I thought I'd do this update on Badminton Warrior. Batman Warrior's been out for around two days now and players have already been giving feedback and based off of that feedback I've made some changes. So the first change is a little slight but I think it will help gameplay. Now when you swing, the hit detection box for the racket activates on a delay. It doesn't activate right away. The idea behind that is when the rack is behind his head, the hit detection box should not be enabled. It's only when the racket comes forward, it'll, it'll get enabled. Now, players are finding that the delay was a little too long, so I just shortened the delay, and now his racket's a little more responsive. Let's see if I can show you. It may be hard to tell, but now the projectiles can get a little closer to Rao before he has to swing. Okay, this next change has to do with projectiles coming from above. I think I showed you in the previous video, or previous gameplay video, that in order to hit these spider cannons, you actually have to move back and then hit up. Otherwise, if you just stand there, those projectiles will hit the player in the head. And players felt like you should be able to just stand there and hit the projectile up. So what I did was I moved the hit detection um, part of the racket a little up into the back so it actually covers his head as well. So now, oh, let's see if I can just stand here. There you go. Yeah, so now I can just stand here and then when he shoots at the player's head, I'm still able to deflect it up without having to move back. So those are the two big changes. There's a free demo out, so I'd encourage you to try out Badminton Warrior and then join the community groups and tell me how I can make the game better because really I'm just a solo developer. I don't have that many people playtesting this stuff and I wanna make the game fun for you guys. Well, I guess that's it for me. I'll see you next time.